Oh, good evening. If you can't really tell, I'm pretty uh, pretty drunk right now. Uh, today was the last. Sorry. Um, today was the last day of our uh, uh, band rehearsals, uh, which is just band and backline, and uh, things went great. The band sounds amazing. They're playing so good right now. Um, I shot some cool time lapses. Those will be up tomorrow, and there'll be some stuff on uh, Death Leopard's site. Um, however, right now, I am a little too drunk to edit. Uh, we had a uh, our, uh, our normal uh, first night get-together uh, to meet the new crew guys and truck drivers and kind of hang out a little bit and, you know, sort of catch up. And <laughs> I was the last guy's leave, so I'm, I'm uh, pretty well buzzed right now. Um, yeah, lots and lots of beer, lots of shots. Uh, good, good night, but, uh, yeah. You guys, you know, you can tell I'm probably slurring like a, slurring a bastard right now, and, uh, I'm sure the eyes are looking pretty red. Anyways, I'll get, you know, down my day here. So, uh, today was a great day, um, so we, we finished up rehearsals. We were at, uh, uh, Botch, Avia uh, Botch Aviation um, in Norfolk, or no, or Nor Norwood? Somewhere in in, uh, in uh, Massachusetts. About an hour south or so, or 40, 45 minutes, hour south of Boston. Uh, cool airplane hangar. Um, there will be some cool like video time lapse stuff up tomorrow. And so, as I said, there will be some stuff on, on Death Lover's site. I have, I have to edit this shit, but. Uh, Sorry, the the, uh, the footage. Um, but right now, I'm just a little too uh, a little too relaxed to do so. Um, so it was our last day, and, and the band was you know they basically walked in, they just ran you know tore through the set, um, and everybody sounds great. I mean, Rick is playing amazingly well. Um, as I said yesterday or the day before, uh, I took one of Rick's touring kits to his house. So he's been practicing with one of the touring kits, and uh, which is a little different set than you know the normal house kit. And uh, he's just on fire. He's playing great. You know his uh, his foot stuff is amazing. That you know the kick drum work is awesome. Uh, Phil was all over top of it. Uh, Joe sounds so good right now. Um, Vince has got a bit of a cold right now actually, so he's um, he's about to tour with Last in Line, uh, just you know killing it because you know Viv kills it. But he's been uh, sort of getting over a little bit of flu right now, so um, his, uh, he wasn't singing at all today. But still playing like a demon because, you know, Vivian's, well, Vivian Campbell, and he's awesome. Uh, and, you know, Sav is, you know, Sav is Sav. So they were playing so good. The show is, is so on top. It's such a great just experience. Uh, it's so nice to, you know, just to get back on the road with these guys and just, you know, have the, the vibe again. Uh, we and we, we finished loading up and we are uh, uh, you know heading south back to, or sorry, heading north uh, off to our first show which is in uh, New Hampshire and t uh, tonight we have a uh, our little get to, you know our annual get together to start the tour and which is great it's just so nice, you know it's nice to be able to catch up with everybody and, and uh, drink way too much beer and way too many shots. Um, we've we've uh, you know we changed some of our bus assignments from the last couple of years. And so normally, last few years, we've had, we have like a production bus, which is like basically production people, um, our carps, and our lighting crew is on one bus. We have a bus that has typically our video crew and sound crew, and we have a bus that basically is a backline crew with our front house guy, our, our LD, and then our production, uh, if you have a production staff, people like our VIP person, our production coordinator, our wardrobe girl. Well, this year, our pressure manager decided to change things up a little bit. And we swapped basically the women on our bus, which is our VIP person, production coordinator, and wardrobe for our sound crew. So the bus we have now has the I want is the backline crew and the sound crew and our LD. Um, we have dubbed our bus the, uh, the Betty Ford bus. Because we took all the people who like to have a good time on tour and put them all on one bus. And as you can tell from the video tonight, we like to have a good time. So uh, it's going to be a, <laughs> an interesting tour. Um, hopefully none of us uh, goes over the deep end. It's not in a bad way. 
Um, but anyways, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a good fun tour. I'm so looking forward to being back on the road. Uh, it's just being at rehearsals are great. I love everybody this crew. It, it, I mean, we have a we have a new uh, production coordinator this year. Um, we've had, we only had a couple actually a few a few people change over. I think we had like one lighting person change over, one um, one carp change over, and our production coordinator. I was telling her today, like it's it's one of the the best tours I've ever been on as far as a crew vibe. Um, and you guys know this. I mean, like for we, you know when people are off tour, we keep in touch. You know, I mean, for the fact that you know we spend as much time as we do together, you know, on on stage or on the show days, on days off we all hang out. I mean, I I talk to the you know a family of people on that I work with on a weekly or monthly basis when I'm when I'm home. You know, because we we all get along, so it's it's just it's a great tour to be back on. I'm so happy to see everybody again. Um, anyway, so so like we're we're back out. It's a great time, and um, oh, I also had a chance to uh, chat with my friend Aaron this morning. Um, I haven't talked to her since she left LA about a week ago. That was a great time too. Like um, this kid with her. Uh, I mentioned you, uh, I downloaded uh, Google Duo which is a cross-platform video chat app, which is great. Um, she's an Android person. I'm an a iPhone user. And it was really kind of cool to catch with her this morning, work on a few of our, our uh, business ideas we were working on for some stuff. So, um, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to get off the phone. I'm going to <laughs> get off the phone. I'm going to get off the webcam or the, the video this morning or tonight. I don't, I, I don't tell you this morning. I have to uh, stop this recording, get it uploaded, because I have a lobby call tomorrow morning. Um, and while the entire tour is loaded and set up, Backland sells to, uh, to, to load it tomorrow morning uh, to do our uh, our final production, you know, line check, sound check with the boys tomorrow um, to do this amazing tour. So I shall, I shall catch you guys tomorrow. Uh, there will be some cool uh, time lapse video stuff tomorrow. I did do a, a few time like mobile time lapse of the iPhone during a setup, and I have some cool um, time lapses with the GoPro of us dumping our truck. I also did a time lapse day of the the boys while they're doing their 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 uh, their run through the show, and I got a little short interview with uh, with Rick and with Phil. Um, the majority of that stuff will probably end up on the DefLep website as well as their 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 uh, YouTube page, but I'll have some of it on mine. Uh, I still need to run through the manager to verify what parts I can use use with uh, my page. Um, it might be the only difference I have with with my little vlog versus theirs is I don't actually use actual Def Leppard music um, on on my page. You know, but the uh, there will be some cool stuff to, tomorrow. I, if if it's just on their page, I'll send you a link. Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm <laughs> I'm done. I'm sure it's eight and a half minutes in. If you were still listening or watching, I'm amazed. Uh, okay, guys, tomorrow. Thanks.